While reality shows are mainstream of entertainment, a lot of horrible things can unfold on and off the camera. However, for Swamp People, even the cast has had a strong record of criminal activities. There's not always a permanent cast, but while a few people have lasted for all 11 seasons, the majority of the cast leaves after a season or so. Over such a vast casting, here is the rundown of several crimes that Swamp People's cast have been convicted of and charged for. But most of these offenses include former members, though the new cast is a little criminal background. Rogers A. Rivers Jr., who had been on the show for only one season, was convicted in 2017 for multiple offenses, according to Looper. Rivers shot and killed alligators, like most alligator hunters, so that he could market them. But in his case, among other licensing-related charges, he sold alligator meat unlawfully. He had been found with cannabis on him as well, but his crime is not that extreme relative to his peers' one. Chase Landry was convicted in 2016 for shooting persons who were on a shrimp cruise. Looper confirmed that Landry just did that because he tried to inform certain people that they were heading too fast on their ships, although that sounds terrible. Landry has continued on the show all through his arrest. Nick Payne becomes the first cast member to be arrested for assault, according to Looper. He's only been on the series for one season, but he nevertheless has a long record. Previously, he was guilty of simple battery, and further in his career, he was accused of hitting an officer and resisting arrest. As per Looper, Joe LaFont, who was on the show for several seasons but has since quit, has a complex history of domestic abuse. He was detained in 2012 for injuring his girlfriend with a cigarette, as well as repeatedly hitting her. He was again convicted on related charges in 2013 and 2015. In 2015, he was also guilty of crushing two of his girlfriend's ribs after he grabbed them. In 2013, J. Paul Molinier and R.J. Molinier Jr., the father and son duo, were arrested after being charged with harming someone during a road rage attack. Looper reported that the Molineris claimed to be the targets of the attack in reality. It's not clear what the court found, but no matter what, the two quit the show in season 10.